The perfect drone for small police and fire departments. That's coming up next. Hey everybody, David Plummer here from Aerial Influence. Thank you so much for checking out the channel. If you love drones, if you love drones, they're all about business and municipalities and helping with search and rescue, you've come to the right place. Now today we're talking about drones for police and fire departments, specifically the small ones, the ones that maybe can't afford a Matrice 210. Okay, the Matrice 210, I'm gonna say it out right, that's the best drone for police and fire departments. In general, you're gonna get the best quality, you're gonna get the most reliability, great machines, but those are tens of twenties of thousands of dollars. They can get super, super expensive. But we've got an alternative. This is one that some people scoff at a little bit because they think the quality is not high enough, but here's what I'll say. The DJI Mavic 2 Enterprise Dual is a game changer. You pair that with a smart controller, you've got a really powerful combo. Not only are you getting a low grade thermal, I, now I said it, it's low grade thermal. We know that it is not the same quality as an X-T2, we get it. But if time is of the essence, if there's a search and rescue mission underway and you need to get a drone up in the air quickly, this is the way to go. Here's why, the Mavic can be deployed in under a minute. Get out of your car, put it on the ground, start up the smart controller, you're up in the air with a thermal image in less than one minute. Now the dual sister, the Zoom is a great drone as well. It has that six times zoom range. That's awesome, we love that drone, but we really think the dual is what police and fire departments are looking for. They wanna be able to use it in emergency situations when they're trying to find a missing person, when they're trying to find the heat source of a fire, when they're trying to locate their firemen around a fire. This is what is gonna make sense for them. But what I've also learned is that another added bonus for the Mavic 2 Enterprise Dual is that it does 3D mapping. So I tested this out. I am not a mapping expert in any capacity. I've done very little of it, but I got into the smart controller. I went into their mapping function. I set a perimeter and I went ahead and I ran a map. Uh, I put a tractor out in the middle of our field, a John Deere tractor, and I ran a map. It did five separate maps going in different directions, making sure it got enough photos uh, to construct the entire map, uploaded it all to Drone Deploy, gave me a day, and they spit out a 3D map. You can take a look at it right here. It's not gonna be at the quality of something like a Phantom 4 RTK would be, obviously, uh, but you're still getting a 3D map. You can do accident reconstruction with this, you can do crime scene reconstruction with this, as I said, it's not gonna be as accurate as something like a Phantom 4 RTK. We can sell you that one too. But for those of you looking to get started with a drone for under $5,000, it's even less than that, honestly, you can have a Mavic 2 Enterprise Dual along with a smart controller, and it comes with one year of DJI Enterprise Shield. So if you wreck the drone for any reason, they're gonna send it back. I don't think it's gonna wreck unless you're being really dangerous. This thing has so many sensors on it, I think it would be really hard to wreck it. But we know anything can happen, so it's a good thing to have that insurance built into the price of this. And when I say this thing is great for search and rescue and for small police and fire departments, it's because you're not only getting a thermal drone, which is great, you're getting a 4K image, uh, you're also getting these attachments that go on top. So you get a spotlight, you get a beacon light, and you get a speaker. So the speaker is really powerful, the spotlight is really powerful, the beacon, you can use it if you've got a night waiver, uh, but these are awesome little attachments. I hear they're gonna be coming out with more attachments in the future, DJI is, and, and potentially even opening up to third party uh, that can develop things that can go into this attachment. So. So pretty awesome, exciting, and for any small police and fire department, this would make a ton of sense for under five grand. Even if you don't buy it from us, go buy it from your local dealer. But you guys should have it. It should be mandatory at every small police and fire department. It is too powerful and honestly too inexpensive uh, for you not to have it. I would not wanna be the police and fire department where there was a missing kid and a parent saying, you know, take the drone up. And you guys say, oh, we don't have one. Why? Because we didn't want to spend less than $5,000 to save a bunch of lives. Uh, okay, I'm gonna get down off my, off my pedestal, uh, but we hope you will come back. We hope you'll like and subscribe to this page and we'll see you next time.